Hey, hey, what's cracking? Um, doing my first vlog here in uh, Ames, Iowa. Uh, so Ray or arrived here at like seven fifty or so. Left around three fifty, about four hours or so. And uh, I'll give you a little tour of the room. I guess I got my own room because uh, uh, my uh, um, my travel arrangements had a. Uh, Sweet, uh, sweet deal where they could use their points to get us a room. So, um, just got back from supper not too long ago, but uh, let's do a tour real quick here. Here's the uh, room 248, two floor of the Hampton, or two floors of the Hampton. Uh, pretty spacious bathroom. Uh, rocking that Neutrogena soap, towels. Just kind of pretty, pretty standard. I guess uh, one thing I did notice that there was like no fan, so if like you take a shower, it's kind of a bit kind of steamy. At least I haven't found where the fan is located. That's the light right there, and this one is like a no go. But pretty big. Is the bathroom? There's me. Um, rocking my new kicks. Nike Freeze 4.0. I haven't checked this out. No dead body or anything in here. <laughs> uh, extra linens and stuff. Let's um, Mirrors. Uh, just on my Chromebook not too long ago, figuring out the distance and time to where we need to play and where we need to go. Uh, Got my own king size bed. Uh, clock over there. What's this? Just a charge po charge point. It's pretty cool. I got a tablet, standard phone. Got I don't know. Is that floor? Was that TR floor? I don't know what that name is, but that's the housekeeper or whatever. I uh, figured out a solution for the stand, so I just took a piece off my tripod and taped that on with some uh, medical tape and we're just using this tripod mount we just screw that on like so goes on there like that boom and then we'll put the GoPro with the uh, notch inside there so that's how that'll fit clamp is working pretty well we'll see if we can find something to clamp that to uh, TV got some ESPN ESPN going on. It's kind of a weird angle. I don't know if like the cleaning lady was like cleaning the bed here and then watching TV, but I don't know how you could just be comfortable watching it at an angle or like over here. So I have to twist that guy. Oh, don't break this thing. Oh, that's pretty cool. So just twist that. Um. We play at play at um, check-ins at check-in is at 8 a.m. tomorrow. Uh, we're about like six to seven minutes away from the stadium. That's where you get the pickup player packets and shirts and stuff. But I don't know if they're open till eight tomorrow. So we'll see if we can drive by there because. Forker building is only a minute away. Um, where did we go eat at? We ate at, I got some pictures, at some unique restaurant. It's pretty cool. It's like a old, like, train station kind of thing. Well, we ate at, like, let's see what it's called. I took a picture. Uh, a couple pictures, actually. It's really different and I recommend it for sure and I hope I hope to go back there anyways uh, let's see I'll show you there's my dessert right there I had a uh, uh, cherry nut ice cream with chocolate fudge cherries um, dinner uh, they're kind of known for their barbecue stuff and smoked uh, smoked meats, I guess, smoked beef, ham, whatever. Uh, it's called the Hickory Park Restaurant. 
And here's the menu just for desserts. Oops, come on. There we go. So that's the menu just for desserts. They have Sundays, splits, malts, shakes. Um, uh, I don't know if they said floats, just regular ice cream. Um, I don't know. Uh, I'll probably post some of these pictures on my blog or whatever, but it reminded me of a, like a Disney World kind of themed uh, restaurant or Walt Disney. Um, like if you go to the Mall of America and you go into like the Mickey Mouse uh, store, it's been a while since I've been in there, but I get that vibe from there. What the heck is that sound? What is that sound? There's some live buzzing sound. It's not my fire alarm, but it could be someone else's. I don't know. <laughs> it's very loud. Or it's louder than what I would like. It probably wouldn't be able to sleep during it. But anyways, um, I was just saying it's like a Mickey Mouse, kind of like Disney World uh, restaurant mixed with like an old train station. Like it's all right. Checking back in. That was actually a real like fire hazard. I think uh, someone said like some O2 uh, pressure thing went off or something like that, and you could hear the fire alarm or fire fire trucks. Coming there this way, um, luckily it didn't take too long. Uh, I thought it would be a longer ordeal, but we finally got back in. We're probably out there for maybe less than 10 minutes, which isn't too bad at all. But it is muggy out there. Ooh, it is not nice. Um, I'm glad that we're playing indoor, but hopefully it's not too muggy. Uh, like I said, I played there, played inside the Forker building last year. I don't think there's AC in there. There's big, humongous fans up there, which maybe I'll get some videos of that because... These fans are pretty ginormous, and um, they're not like going high speeds or anything that change the direction of the balls. But they're big, and they don't put a lot of, a lot of, uh, I don't know, what do you call it, uh, movement, I guess, to keep it super cool in there. So it gets hot, a lot of bodies moving around, uh, a lot of people. So, um, but once I open that door. It was loud. Like you could hear it big time, and it's like one of those alarms going off, like during a fire drill at school, like just ringing in your ear. Um, so it's a good thing that uh, they could figure it out. We didn't have to get a, a different hotel or anything, and lasted a short amount of time. But I did grab my <laughs> my pickleball stuff with me just in case, and my wallet, keys. Um, and phone. Um, I did leave my Chromebook and my other personal stuff here. So I got I got my priorities straight with the pick wall stuff. So we're ready for tomorrow. Uh, I got that mindset that we're still gonna play. And if things went down, if things got blown up here and we had a different hotel, at least I would have my pick wall stuff and we could play. So uh, again, more videos tomorrow. Uh, peace.